Hi, my name is Patrick. This specific video is to help you prepare for the con section for the CAT 22. So it's a four video series. The first video was general broad plan for the CAT preparation. This specific video is for the con section. Your next video will be for DLR and the last will be for verbal. So mainly if you're starting for June from June 22 for CAT 22, CAT is normally November end. You have some time, enough time to prepare for the CAT and do well in the CAT. So this should give you a broad guidelines as to how to go about prepare. So generally giving the whole idea, you need to try to complete your syllabus in two months. So your June and July month, which is there where you can complete the syllabus. Then maybe one month for revision. So any topic where you're not comfortable with, you can revise and write maybe mock in intervals. And last, you should focus on writing more mocks and practice. So write mocks, identify your weak areas and then practice those areas. That will be from September to November. Broad schedule in terms of preparation. So syllabus first round, you have June, July, two months, around 61 days. Let's say you're going to prepare for 60 days. For mathematics, spend two to four hours a day, depending on the time you're available. So if you're at home, then maybe you can spend four hours a day for preparation. But maybe if you're working or in college, spend two hours a day for con section. This is a broad area to how will you divide your time or in terms of days for each topic. For example, number system, you may take four days. Number system is slightly a longer topic, but there are a lot of concepts in number system which are not important. I normally recommend students maybe to start with averages. Okay, average, percentage, profit loss, and then come later on to number system. So finish the first five, six topics, and maybe before you do time slip distance, you can maybe come back to number system, or before you do interest, you can come back to number system and then try to solve. So I have only given two days for percentage, profit and loss. So ideally this topic should be comfortable because I've done it in school and may be comfortable. So during these two days, focus on trying to solve sums, just to be familiar with basic type of sums. Don't get into too details right now. You don't have a time. If you feel you're not comfortable at any topic during this syllabus completion, come back during revision and try to solve. It is possible that some of the topics that you're doing out here may not be important for CAT. For example, in number system, there is remainder theorem and a lot of different concepts. Even in permutation, combination, there are a lot of difficult concepts which don't come in the CAT exam. So don't break your head in trying to understand difficult concepts in difficult areas. This syllabus should be to basically try to be comfortable with the topics so that you understand it and you can solve few basic sums on it. How to solve? I mean, if you're looking at quant, try solving a few sums before going to theory. That's what I normally recommend because I've gone to this syllabus in your school. So at least try it. You may not get the answer, but try. When you try that, it helps you to understand and think better. Also go to the theory. Okay, go to the theory. Okay, after once you're finished, sorry, trying to solve few sums and then again, solve some basic sums. Okay, so try doing this. Apart from this, ensure that you do calculation practice every day. Calculation is very important to build up speed. It also helps to build better. We'll come back to that later. But yes, People normally ignore calculation and that ensures that you waste a lot of time on calculation in the exam. So ensure that you're comfortable with basic calculations. Though CAT has a CALCI, online CALCI, but remember other exams don't have a calculator. Also in CAT, it's preferred that you don't use a calculator too much. Only for difficult sums you use calculator, else you can avoid it, right? So try to do this, follow this process. I hope this will help you with regards to con preparation. We will have separate videos for DILR and verbal. You can go through it to help you in your preparation. Thank you.